I don't begrudge anybody who is using all these sexy, shiny, new AI tools to make money. I don't like to brag, but I myself have made well over $80 thanks to the generous donations of you, our thousands of viewers. That's nearly three cents per viewer. So anyway, thanks for that. I want you to know that I'll remain as humble, modest, lovable, and outrageously handsome as always, even as I inch ever closer to becoming a big money three-figure earner. There's going to be a but, isn't there? But! I hate it when you install so-called free open source software only to discover that it's wired to some subscription service you have to pay for. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Go back to that butt picture. AI tips with Jay. Firecrawl is a really cool web scraper and content harvester that turns web content into formats easily consumed by AI's large language models, or LLMs. Since our Pocket Grok library can already read content, it seemed like it would be pretty easy for an impressively brilliant programmer to give it Firecrawl's functionality. And it was. Yeah? Who did you hire? Go look at more butt pictures. In this latest upgrade to Pocket Grok, I've added more robust web scraping and web crawling capabilities. The README file has plenty of examples, but I knew once I compared Pocket Grok to Firecrawl, You'd want me to put my money where my mouth is. You don't have any money. Weren't you listening? I have over 80 bucks. I'm nearly a hundred air. Here I've split the screen, showing the $88 a month commercial fire crawl package on the top of the page, and our new free grok crawl solution powered by pocket grok on the bottom. Each mode offers a variety of options. We'll stick to the defaults for now and do a simple URL scrape of example.com. It's a small website, so we quickly get our results. The page's contents in our choice of markup or JavaScript formats. Simple enough. Our grok crawl solution works identically to fire crawl. We'll punch in the example.com site again. Looking over our options, we see the additional choice of straight HTML results available to us as well. We'll also select structured JSON data so you can see everything Grok Crawl has to offer. Being powered by Grok, everything is rendered for us in a few milliseconds. Here we see our markdown results, our extracted HTML code, and finally our example.com web page content rendered as JSON. Next, we'll take a look at the crawl feature, which, as you might suspect, goes beyond simply scraping a site's home page. It follows the internal links of the site to collect as much of the content as you specify. Here in the options, we'll ask it to only scrape two pages and to go no further than two hops when exploring the site. This operation takes a little longer, but Firecrawl keeps us updated on its progress as it hops from page to page collecting its information for us. It shows us the first page as soon as it's able to render the contents. Again, we see both markup and JavaScript. And there's the second page, offering us similar results. While we're here, we may as well select the map feature. This merely collects and displays the internal links from a site. There are a lot of tools that do this, so it's not that big a deal. But I wanted you to see everything. I'll punch in the Yahoo website because I know it has quite a few internal links. And after a few seconds, there they are. Now we'll put Grok Crawl through the same paces. Let's switch from our single page web scraping feature to the full featured web crawling selection. And again, we'll make the Nobel Prize website our guinea pig for the experiment. Again, we'll go two and two for our pages and hops to keep things short and sweet, and off we go. Hopefully you noticed how much faster our Grok Crawl solution was. Again, we have our friends at Grok to thank for that. All hail Grok. All hail Grok! There's our HTML. There's a lot of HTML. And all our structured data, broken down by element type, it looks like. So, you get the idea. Oh, let's take a quick look at the mapping function, too. We'll punch in yahoo.com for that, same as before. I don't think we have anything special in the options, but I'll check. Nope. You won't be surprised that, again, when I click on the Run button, our Grok Crawl solution returns our results in the blink of an eye. All hail gr Wait, are we not still doing that? No, we're not still doing that. Do we have time to look at another butt? You want to see another butt? No, pull up your pants. Pull up your pants! Not your thing, 
cool take a hike otherwise subscribe and like to ai tips with jay ai tips with jay hooray ai 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 tips with jay AI Tips with Jay is a copyrighted production of j.gravel.us. All rights reserved by AI Tips with Jay.